Let's uh, take a look at the different number classification systems. And these are, it's kind of review. You should should have maybe learned some of these terms before, but it's okay to, re to review them. So we have some numbers like 1, 2, 3, so on, 4, 5. These we call natural numbers. So the natural numbers are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, so on and so forth. Then we have another category of numbers that we call whole numbers. And whole numbers include all of these natural numbers and also the number 0. So whole numbers are 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Then we can expand, we'll use a different color here, green, to integers. Whoops. And integers include all of the whole numbers. So integers are 0, and they're 1, and they're 2, and they're 3. And then they're also the negative numbers. So the opposite of the natural numbers. So negative 1, negative 2, negative 3, so on and so forth. So natural numbers are 1, 2, 3. Whole numbers are 0, 1, 2, 3. And integers are all of these numbers plus the negatives. And then we could add, finally, the rational numbers, which are all of these guys. Plus we start to add all of the fractions, like 3 sevenths and 5 ninths. And there are also numbers that have decimals, like 7.3. And they're decimals that can go on forever, like 4.11111, as long as they're repeating, or 3.626262. So those are all rational numbers. So rational numbers are all of the naturals, the wholes, and the integers, plus any number that can be written as a fraction, or there are decimals that either end, like 7.3, or have repeating patterns that go on forever. But in this little video, we're going to look at another weird set of numbers. Let's make them purple, that we call irrational numbers. And irrational, the word irrational just kind of means strange or, or different or not, not normal. And irrational numbers, they're kind of in a category all by themselves. They have decimals that um, go on forever and have no repeating pattern. So 3.6198432. So any decimal that goes on forever and does kind of strange or weird things, no pattern, uh, we call irrational numbers. Now there's some, some famous ones like pi. Pi we say is approximately 3.14. But if I get my calculator out here, and punch in pi, it says it's 3.14159265.4, and it actually goes on forever. It just doesn't show all the decimals. The other, other numbers that are irrational are often square roots. So, for instance, if I take the square root of 2, punch that into the calculator, It has a decimal that goes on forever uh, and never repeats. So many of our uh, square roots, you could do the square root of 7. You couldn't do the square root of 9 because the square root of 9 is, is 3, which is a natural number. So not all square roots, but many of our square roots are irrational numbers. So we're going to look a little bit here at irrational numbers and later on radicals. That, um, that have decimals that would go on forever but never repeat. 